Hey guys, have you ever wanted to incorporate Hello Bar with your WordPress website? Well, in today's video, that is exactly what we're going to do. Hey guys, welcome to WP Cliff Notes, where we teach tips, tricks, and hacks about WordPress. If you're new to my channel, guys, my name's Cliff Kennedy, and I would love for you to subscribe to my channel. And if you love this video at the end, or even in the middle, hit that like button. Guys, if you're ready to learn how to incorporate Hello Bar with your WordPress website, let's jump to the computer. Welcome to today's tutorial. Today, we're going to learn how to install Hello Bar on your website to collect emails or send people to different websites. So if you're ready to get started, let's jump into the tutorial. But before we do, I want to invite every single one of you to go to acfclass.com and sign up for my free mini course all about ACF, Advanced Custom Fields Plugin and it will really help you develop websites fast and easy. If you're interested, you can go to acfclass.com and that will be down here in the lower left hand corner. Again guys, that's acfclass.com. All right, let's jump into this tutorial. So we have our website and it's WPCN demos dot local. So and it's because the reason it's dot local is because I am developing this website locally with local by flywheel. So first we are gonna put our website in here WPCN demos dot local and we're gonna Say create account and it's going to ask us to log in we already have an account so we are going to go to already a user I'm going to put my username in and then it will there we go wrong email all right it will log me in so we're going to go to add new site and we are going to go to demos.local and then we're going to hit create site and then we come to this screen where we select a goal for our hello bar and they have five different types one is to promote a sale or a discount the second one is to get people to call you the third one is to grow your mailing list and the fourth one is to get Facebook likes and then the fifth one is any other goal that you want so we're gonna go with a mailing list so we're gonna hit select and right here this is the text that we want on the website so we'll say join we'll leave it as is and then we'll hit subscribe and we'll say continue and it's not loading the site because my website is not live on the web we can do this several different ways we can have the bar itself we can have a modal and then it'll load up like this and or we can have a little slide out which will look like this where it slides out at the bottom or we can have a page takeover which pretty much takes over your entire page like so so you can do anything that you want to with this i kind of like the regular hello bar because it doesn't take up much space and it alerts people so we're gonna go and pick one for our website we'll go with this one and then we will hit next and we can always change the colors so i'm gonna grab the colors of my website I like it like that and then 
I want the text to be white and then I'm gonna make this button orange I'm gonna go here and then we're gonna hit next and it's gonna take us to who we want to target so after a certain amount of time when they close it do we want to display it again or after a conversion don't display it you can pick different things I'm just gonna say leave it and I'm gonna hit save and publish and then it brings you to this page so there's several ways that you can install a hello bar on your website the first one is regular code so if you're a developer or if you know code um, you can do this and all it is is a little script where you paste right before the closing body tag in your footer or you can download this plugin and install it that way if you don't know code I will show you both ways first we are gonna copy this paste it there and then I'm gonna open up VS code which is pretty much my favorite one of my favorite editors that's free and then we're gonna hit paste and I'm gonna hit save and then we're gonna go to my website I'm gonna refresh my website and that should show right here there it goes and that's pretty much how easy it is to install hello bar on your website I will also show you via the plugin you can download the plugin and go to download we're gonna download it to the desktop first off I want to go ahead and come out comment out this code so it doesn't load twice and we're gonna refresh this to make sure it disappears it's not loading so we are gonna go to actually we're just gonna go to the back and then we will go to plugins and we will go to add new plugin and we will go to upload plugin and we will go to choose called hello bar and we will upload that plugin hit install and then activate alright after you activate the plugin there are no settings for the plugin it automatically knows what hello bar you have active so when you go to the front of your website whatever settings you told it to do it will load them in and there you go and that's pretty much how you install hello bar on your website if you have any questions about hello bar please comment below and the question of the day is how do you collect leads on your website or do you use hello bar on your website That's how easy it is to incorporate Hello Bar with your WordPress website. I hope today's tutorial has made WordPress development simple, fun, and easy for you. If you haven't subscribed yet, now's the time to do it. Hit that subscribe button and then hit the bell to get notified for every video I upload. Also, if you like this video or it was any help to you at all, slap that like button as well. Until next time guys, my name's Cliff Kennedy and I will see you in further episodes. Later.